a little hot day. Oh, that's just your normal look. Because it's, it's 111 today, so it's hot. It is extremely hot here. It's a heat wave here because it's so hot here. It's by over 100 degrees. A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back. Take my time, just enjoy the ride. We are having sunscreen spit on the RV today. We've been in Vegas for the past week. Uh, we've spent a lot of time in Clovis, New Mexico. We're going to be in Phoenix for almost a month. In very hot areas. And we have decided to put sunscreens on the RV. When we got here, they actually had advertisements for sunscreens at your site. Meaning they come and they measure and they make them right here on site for us. We've looked at them in the past and we thought about getting them with the magnets. These are not magnets. These are snap-ons. So it was a little bit different than we originally decided to do. However, the cost is much better for us, as well as we don't have to wait eight weeks, six to eight weeks to get them while we're sitting here in Vegas. And we would not have them at that point. So we'd be leaving Vegas by the six to eight week mark. This allows us for the next three weeks while we're still here to actually have some relief from the sun and the heat, especially with the puppy dogs in the, in the vehicle with us uh, in the RV. So he is supposed to be here soon. It's almost 7 a.m. out here in Las Vegas. He's supposed to be here soon and he will get started, but we'll, uh, we'll get some video of him doing this. And hopefully after he's finished, we'll be able to open up our front screens during the day and be able to look out uh, without people looking in. And then also have some relief from the sun and maybe cool it down in here, five to 10 degrees inside the RV uh, during the day while it's 110 degrees out here because while it's that, our ACs have been doing really good. However, uh, still in the you know 83 to 85 inside the RV, and it'd be nice if we could get into the 70s, especially for the puppy dogs. We are working on that today, and he should be here soon for us to get started. He said between 7 and 7.30, it's almost 7. We'll get some video of him doing it, and then we'll check back with y'all after a few days and let you know if they've done as you know advertised. Mm -hmm. As you can see, it's very clean looking. All right, so we do have the snaps. So the snaps would be there uh, after we take these off. But I believe it really has enhanced the front look of the RV. As you see, you cannot see in from the outside during the daytime. The windshield wiper covers did come with it but it does make it look very nice, clean. And the good thing is it has cooled off. So it's really made, I would say a good 10 degrees cooler. So prior to us getting the sunscreens, we were struggling to keep it under 85 inside, especially in the front part of the RV. We were pretty much spending the rest of the RV afternoons 
the back side of the RV uh, to be like an 83. And after putting these on, we're staying around 80 degrees inside. So it really has cooled off the inside of the RV by about 10 degrees. RV Sunshades of Vegas. This is not a paid advertisement, but so far after a few days, we've had it for five days now. Um, we've really liked the look at them. And it, like I said, it really has cooled us off by about 10 degrees. This is what it looks like from the inside. You can see, you can see out plainly. Again, from the outside, I showed you where you cannot see in, at least during the daytime because of the reflection, and the way it's built. But from the inside, you can definitely see out so this has made it nice where we have more light in here during the day, and it is staying about 10 degrees cooler. Now we got the sunscreens on the main big three windows. We do plan on putting sunscreens on a few more windows of the RV. Those windows are the door window, the window over the living room area, uh, the dog window down here. And then we'll show you the other two windows on the other side, which are over the couch and the dining room table. This is the dog window. We're going to do one over this window. We'll get one over the door window and it is over the living room. Our TV is right there. We're going to get one over that because in the afternoon, the sun shines in there. It's pretty hot. And you can still see the radiant barrier we have up right now because we don't have the sunscreens in these windows. So we have the radiant barrier. We're going to get ones for these windows right here as the sun does shine in here pretty hot in the mornings and afternoons. Once we get those done, maybe next week, uh, we are splitting it up to make it economical for us. Once those are done, uh, then the RV will be complete with sunscreens. Hope y'all enjoyed the tour of our new sunscreens. Been absolutely great over the last five days. It has cooled us off inside. If you need sunshades and you're here in Vegas, go to RV Sunshades by Solarista. We'll put all their information down in the link below. Y'all have a good week. A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back. Take my time, just enjoy the ride.